Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say, if you like this content, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Also, if you want a video of your own, make sure to commission me either when I'm live on YouTube, or you can DM me through my public Discord server. Anyway, let me not take up your time. Enjoy the video. And thank you, Moonstar, from my public Discord server for the commissioned video. <laughs> oh! Good heavens! Where did you come from? Well, you're in my way, so excuse me, I have shopping- uh, wait, hold on. You're the human that fell from Earth, aren't you? Well, isn't this quite a surprise? I didn't think I would be visited by such famous people at this time. And what would be the pleasure for meeting the ever first human to ever survive down here in hell? Oh, I see you have questions for me. Well, I guess I have time. Here, yeah, follow me. I'm just doing a few shopping sprees before I head back to my home. Yes, well, I, um, well, I am royalty. I do have lots of money, so I do like to spend my money on myself a few times. But enough about me. Let's talk about you. Why did you come to me specifically? Hmm, I see. Well, I don't think I've opened any portals to a human realm. You might want to talk to that disgusting creature Stolis. They have the power to open portals to the human world with the Necronomicon. Oh, yeah, well, we already talked to them. Mm, all right. Well, I mean, like I said, I didn't want to open any torta portal, and nor I didn't. So, coming to me for that issue was kind of, um, obsolete, for better words. Heavens no, I have no... I have nothing to do up there in Earth. Disgusting little creatures themselves. No offense. Well, I've been dealing with my sister, and she's being a bit of a handful right now. You know how Goishas can be. Some of them can be up in their head a little too much. Yes, yes, well, with my sister being a handful and also all sorts of hiring of different people, it's been quite a busy few months for me. I just decided to take a little break away from my sister and just go on a few shopping sprees, that's all. I haven't done anything to do with magic or anything out of the ordinary. You know, like you said, opening portals for the human realm. I have not done that. I did see on the news that you had a meeting up in heaven with God himself. Now, how did you land such a meeting? Especially if you're a resident of hell as well. Really, you had Lucifer Morningstar 
set up a meeting for you. I didn't know that you had contacts like that. It's very interesting to know. Have you ever thought of, you know, if Lucifer Morningstar opened that portal for you to purposely fall into his lap? Oh, human, trust me, your story's everywhere. It's all over the news, the television. The story goes that you fell through a hellish portal right into the lands of hell, right into Lucifer's house. It's everywhere on the television. Yes, it's quite an interesting story, and also quite interesting on how you're traveling through circles so quickly. I mean, you've talked to so many sins that they have been asked if the human who is in hell has talked to them, and most of the sins said yes already. The only ones you haven't seen are Beelzebub and Satan. And maybe Leviathan. I can't really remember. I've been too busy. Yes, yes. You seem like a very busy person. So, I'll make this short, then. I did not open any type of portal to the human realm. That was not me. No, I do not think that my sister has opened a portal either. She's been too busy obsessing over her ex-husband and attempting to assassinate him with hired assassins. Hmm. Well, I didn't really think of that. You could ask the assassin that was hired to kill Stolis. See if he has any contacts with more higher-up people that can also open portals to the human realm. Though I doubt it, though. Where will he be located? Hmm, well... You're gonna have to check all sorts of rings, then. I mean, you can travel them quite quickly, can you not? Yes, that's what I thought. Well, if you're done here with me, I have lots of shopping to do. So, if you wouldn't mind just leaving me alone, I would greatly appreciate it. Mm, yes, ta-ta. Hmm. Although it would be quite helpful to have the human, the only human, around hell. Wait, 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 wait. Before you get going, would you like to head back to my palace? Have a few drinks? Maybe even have a conversation? Or maybe even, you know... Have an invitation to be at my palace at any time you please. I mean, after all, you can travel very quickly. Oh, are you sure? I do not mind the company. And plus, I don't think my sister would mind the company either. She's been very lonely as of recently. And I don't think most Goishas are interested in her right now because of the whole situation with Stolas and her. Are you sure? Ugh. Fine. 
or whatever. Well, if you are heading out now, it has been quite a pleasure to see and hear from the Hell's Wanderer themselves. And, before you go, take my card. It has my phone number on it. You can contact me at any time you please. Alright. Splendid, splendid. I hope to hear more from you, Hell's Wanderer. Have a fantastic night. Thank <laughs> you.